There is not just one story to be told tonight in the Indian Super League. There are many. As many as Sergio Libera's systems, Manolo Marquez keeps going kaching every time he sets foot on a football pitch. Never, ever returning empty hand. Uh, Princeton Rebello is preferred over Lenny Rodriguez. That might come as a shock to some, but Princeton Rebello. For Manolo Marquez, the 20 year old, Marquez mentioning that he is. The in those pots, reset. It is first versus second. Manolo and Sergio tonight. Ivan and Peter will have a say. Antonio waits in Kolkata. But there can only be one ruler of this floating kingdom. That is the Indian Super League. Manolo's cuatro des tres uno is a crowd. Maceritan. Oh, important touch from Jay Gupta because Diego Maurizio was waiting. Oh, back in it comes. And Roy Krishna gets a telling touch. He wins in the air. He wins on the ground. Roy Krishna, the roving hovercraft of the Indian Super League. But before all the celebrations kick on, a quick discussion. Was it off or not? It's been given. It is a goal, Orisha lead. Who else but the man for the big moment this year goes to 11 goals in the Indian Super League. Great work. Isak Ralte couldn't find somebody along the ground and the clearance doesn't go far enough from Jay Gupta. An amazing ball from Ame Ranavade just to try and put it back in the mixer. Carlos Martinez for Noah. Couldn't keep it down. And he's been set up again. It was low, but it was straight to Omrinder. They obviously back. Isak Ralte. He's measuring it. And Roy Krishna challenged by the master O'Day. For Brandon. Towards Carlos Martinez, straight to Omrinder. Noah has time to think. Carlos Martinez picks it up on the turn. Amrinder saves. Again and again, a left footed cross. Didn't look like it was going to make its impact inside the box. But Martinez, eight in the 2018 19 season. He had nine clean sheets with Mumbai in the 2020 21 season. He's already got seven, going for his eighth now. Great run from Jacob that had to be brought down by Putea. The position he has to go and foul. Brandon, Amrinder goes up. This time there's no one in the box. Jay Gupta steps in and it takes a hit, Jay Gupta! Mass into velocity! And that is momentum from the monstrous Jay Gupta! Stung again, Sergio Lopera! How about that for power? Jay Gupta is a gore. Loves scoring against Odisha and he loves scoring with that left foot of his. What an absolute bomb. It just got out to him from a clearance from Narendra Gallot. And that left foot, Ame Ranawa, it does not get close. And I'm talking about the possibility of a goal of the season here. Watch this one just go right into the top corner. And Rinda, no chance. What an absolute. Krishna was looking for that return pass, and that'll be half time. A wonderful start for Odisha when Roy Krishna ghosted in and scored the opener. Oh, looking for passes, but now the game is at a stage where they have been scored against. They've scored one, so they need to go for the kill and getting crosses into the box for Martinez is vital. Brandon, it's coming towards O'Day. He thought he would go with his head and he went with his right boot, but it could not come back in. Two to aim at. Brandon, tempting, but he knows that it was not the time to give in to temptation. For Disha. Jahu sends it in. Diego Maurizio. Always tough to keep down. Jahu waits. But the beautiful delivery straight to the keeper via Carlos Delgado. And he has it again. Amai! Lacked any venom. 
Krishna. Inviting Carl McHugh into a challenge. Inviting Amaya to make the run. Amaya's cross in towards Puteya. Very important touch from Ayush Chetri. Jay Gupta leapt for it. Then he's touched. Roy Krishna tried. Jahu towards Carlos Delgado. All it needed was a touch. And somehow Carlos Delgado. There's a clip. A clip for Noah. Flag is stayed down. And it's wide from the number seven. The selection to the team. Isak Ralte takes a look at goal. Oh, off the woodwork. Roy Krishna. Offside. Hamae sets himself up with a really good first touch. I was looking for more curl on that. Marquez has got this spot on. And sometimes when two teams and two head coaches who are so brilliant in their craft.